Tonight, Otis Daly's been looking at a decade of technological change and wonders what the must-have gadgets will be in 2020, Peter. All the boards. <laughs> <laughs> MP3 players, smartphones, e-books, Wi-Fi internet. Who would have predicted that gadgets like these would appear from nowhere and change our lives? It's a brave man who tries to predict what will follow in their wake and define the high tech of the next decade. I'm going to attempt to do that and the answers just might be behind here. This house in Leeds might look fairly standard from the outside, but inside offers a glimpse of how technology could transform our homes in the future. Hi, Otis, come on in. Fraser is part of a team who've turned this house into a show home for what they call integrated technology. Hi, Otis, how you doing? I'm good, how are you? Yeah, good. Thank you. Oh, so this is the kitchen. Yeah, and uh, we've got a control here that basically controls the whole house. Uh, so we can turn all the lights off in the house from here. We can adjust the heating in different rooms. We can also look at the CCTV system. Mm -hmm. We can open the gates. Um, but also we can actually control all the, uh, the movies and the music on the TV as well. Apparently, before too long, all you'll need is one panel and a flat screen TV and your life's sorted. In 10 years time, this will be something that becomes affordable to a lot of households. Yeah, absolutely. As with all this technology, it's, it's uh, over time becoming more and more, and more affordable. Yes, I like that. Another part of everyday life that's been transformed by technology this decade is communication. Distance doesn't matter these days. Wherever you are in the world, you don't need to leave your living room to have a face-to-face -face chat. All you need is a computer, the latest software, and they can be right in front of you at the click of a button. Hello, Mr. Pearson. Ian Pearson makes a living predicting the future. I want to know just how far he thinks technology will take us. In 10 years' time, how will we be conducting this conversation? I think over the next 10 years, it's really quite exciting, but for me, the most important one is augmented reality. I will just look at you, and you'll be sitting right in front of me as if you were in my office. I'll even be able to shake hands with you because we'll have active skin linking my nervous system straight through to the IT. So I'll be able to feel your handshake even though you're, you know, hundreds of kilometers away. Augmented reality sounds like science babble, but it's basically a fancy way of saying we'll be able to mix the virtual world with the real world and it's going to be huge. And while it may seem the stuff of sci-fi fantasy, it's just one of the many fantastical forecasts experts are making. From controlling your computer screen just using the power of your mind, to kitting your kids out in clothes fitted with GPS tracking systems, new technology is set to transform our lives like never before. How about with things like um, cars, for instance? Well, we'll certainly see electronic parking, in fact, cars parking themselves, distancing themselves from the other cars in the fast lane so you can't crash. That'll be fairly routine in every car on the road in 10 years' time. And if cars are just too last century for you, how about spaceships? Virgin aims to bring commercial space flights to the masses before 2020. Back on Earth, technology is ready to help us tackle the social problems of the decade ahead. Okay, this is some technology that we are hoping that the NHS might use. Maybe we should try it out. Okay. If you'd like to sit, sit there and be the patient. You could be my doctor. doctor. Excellent. Okay. Boffins at the University of York are developing new gadgets like this system, which would allow health professionals to hold consultations with patients remotely. Using a variety of cameras, they could get a detailed view of the patient. So I guess for those individuals who are infirm or reluctant to leave their homes, this technology is, is brilliant. It's also much more effective for the, for the medics as well. Uh, and this is not expensive technology. The technological future promises to be an exciting one. And no matter where you are or what you're doing, new gadgets are bound to be at the heart of it. Making some of life's most simple pleasures a little bit more rewarding. Oh, yeah. It's alright, it's waterproof. <laughs> ah!